Hi, this is Council Member Roberto Uranga from the City of Long Beach, 7th District. Today I'm with Phil Tranny, the owner of Phil Tranny's Fine Food and Spirits here in the Bixby Knowles area of Long Beach. Today we have a nice little spread here, some of his signature food that he has here. And we're going to talk to Phil a little bit, learn a bit more about his business, uh, how long has he been here, some of the staff that he has here, and uh, obviously some of this fine food we get to taste today. So Phil, let's start, let's start with the appetizer. What do we got here? Okay, Roberto, my brother. I love you. You know what? You've been always good to me. I'll explain to you all my signature items. You mind if I try some? Go ahead. Okay. Go ahead. Our shrimp cocktails are white Mexican shrimp. They're almost like eating baby lobsters. They're uh, very tasty. People come from all over to eat them. Let's get a little taste here, see how it tastes like. Ooh, very delicious. Crispy. Mm. Yeah. Chunky. You know, it's, it's, it's the best. So what do we have over here? There we have... Uh, Chili and sea bass, my, another signature item that I have. We sell a lot of it. We coat it with a special seasoning that we have, and we, we bake it off in a convection oven at about five or 600 degrees to, to develop a, a crust on it. Then we top it with a very, very healthy uh, herb sauce, we, uh, we call it, juice from the capers and uh, olive oil and garlic. It has, a, has an elegant, crust to it. Top of the middle with a great uh, glass of wine. Here you go, right here. I'll, I'll, I'll have one with you. <laughs> so Phil, so tell me about uh, your, your place here. How long you been here? Uh, when did you get into the restaurant business? Well, or? Roberto, it's, uh, it's a long, long story. I, obviously, I can't, I can't, uh, I have to put it in a nutshell, but uh, <laughs> I've been in the business for 50 years, you know, and uh, obviously I've been here 26 years. So I was with my family. We had, a, we had a famous, famous restaurant in San Pedro called Trainee's Majestic. Mm -hmm. And I was one of five brothers, and my brothers were the ultimate. We were an institution. Great, great spot. The reason why I came to Long Beach is because a uh, good portion of our business from San Pedro came from the east of us, which is Long Beach. Mm -hmm. And uh, we had a great reputation with a lot of civic leaders in the, in the city back in the 60s and 70s. I see sometimes that you have uh, the uh, motorcycle uh, yeah, we get officers the, yeah. uh, have meetings here right. sometimes and you have right. other, other civic groups coming exactly. here. Exactly. So you're open for uh, uh, breakfast or lunch well, or dinner? Or? No, we open 11.30 to 3 every afternoon. Lunch and every, dinner? Uh, lunch and dinner and then we open at 5.30 to uh, closing I call it, you know, 9.30 or 10 o'clock at night. So I just want to say one thing, I have great, great help. Everybody here does their job, and they're all, they all look good. So how many employees do you have? Here I have 30 employees. Let's talk about another one of these dishes that you have right here. That looks okay. like a, a salad. Or we invented that. It's called a pot roast Caesar salad, and that goes back to, believe it or not, my mother. That's a pot roast that was wow. cooked for like seven hours. Wow. And it'll melt in your mouth. You mind if I taste it? No, go ahead. <laughs> That's why we're here. All right, let's see. It's got chunky, mm. uh, chunky beef in it, mm. <clears throat> baked potatoes. That's almost like a meal in itself it right is, there. It is, very much so. Mm. I thought maybe it'd make me world famous once. You know, I thought maybe uh, I'd become a, like a McDonald's hamburger, but it didn't happen. Well, Phil, I want to thank you for uh, hosting us t today. Uh, great food. I've been here. I really highly recommend it to all you folks out there. So this is Go Long Beach. This is Councilmember Roturanga. Thank you for watching.